so you're wondering how to deal with this. Pretty intimidating, isn't it? Sucks to be on the receiving end of this monstrosity of a weapon. However, I have found a method to counter this gun, and I'll give you a hint, it involves almost every other weapon in the game. That's right, all the weapons in Fortnite counter the drum shotgun in some way, it's just important to know the advantages these weapons have. Now you might have noticed that I said almost every weapon. There are two that will never beat the drum shotgun, the anti-vehicle rocket launcher and the pistol. The launcher, it's due to it shooting upwards when fired, by the time it hits the ground, you're already dead. The pistol is because it sucks, even though it shoots fast than the drum, the damage output will never beat a drum shotgun in a small time frame. Also, the pistol is very inaccurate, so it's most effective at close range, like the drum shotgun. It doesn't work, trust me. But before we go into the weapons which counter the drum shotgun, let's have a rundown on the drum shotgun first. A drum shotgun has 12 rounds in its drum, each shooting with a greater damage at close combat. Note that the damage becomes less at longer distances. The damage output increases with more rare variants. The shots shoot at a rate of 4.0, which is almost as fast as the Ranger assault rifle. Also, with a damage output per second of approximately 200, this thing shreds up close. There is a 1.25 times multiplier to hit shots. The user behind it doesn't know how to aim at the head, likes to hide in corners or in bushes so that they can get a surprise attack. But there will always be something that counters a shotgun such as this, and that something is called strategy. Let's start with assault rifles. These weapons are designed to pick off enemies from a mid to long range. Keep yourself distance from the drum wielder so you get more damage on them in a fight. Shotguns? Now this one can be interesting, as none of the shotguns in this chat do one shot. Exclude that mythic. Even that one varies. Utilize your surroundings, take the shot, then keep behind cover. In fact, even use the same cover, as the drum shotgun doesn't do a lot of damage to objects. The auto shotgun, in my opinion, is the best shotgun counter due to the similar damage output despite sacrificing attack speed. If you're using a ranger shotgun, learn to aim for the head. The ranger shotgun is a single firing weapon, which takes a while to reload. Enough time for a drum to shoot three to four times enough to kill you. I suggest practicing with the ranger to understand how much of a mammoth that weapon does in terms of damage. Just thank god the combat shotgun isn't a thing anymore. SMGs. Though SMGs are best at close combat, it is possible to use them at mid range. It does require some skill and practice, but tapping the fire button instead of holding it down makes the SMG into a burst weapon. It helps control the recoil and group your shots from longer range. The Stinger SMG is the best for this as its bloom is a lot smaller than the combat. Snipers. Ah, they're just self explanatory. Much larger range and easy to pick off enemies. The drum doesn't even stand a chance and the opposition will have to force a close combat battle. And the lucky last the revolver. Now I put the revolver in despite it being a pistol. The revolver is a high damage output weapon. The grade is 108 on a single headshot. Now I think that damage output increasing due to more rare revolvers. It also has a lot of range. Range of a sniper with some damage cut off sadly. It's good to understand all the advantages each weapon has in Fortnite. So if this video did help you out by all means leave a like on the video. If you'd like to help me get to a 100 subs on the channel, please subscribe. Also hit the bell so you'll get notifications to upcoming videos. As always, enjoy the game, take care, and I'll see you in the next video.